All right, so before we get into today's video, do me a favor real quick, leave a comment down below what bike of mine you came to the channel because of, whether it was this little baby Z125 and the videos that I've been doing on that. Okay, that scared me for a second. The, uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't know why it freaked me out a lot. But anyway, like I was saying, whether it was the Z125, whether it was the FZ09, or whether it's the DRZ400, which I know is a staple on this channel and basically what I'd say started this channel because it's really what kind of got this channel to where it is today. So leave me a comment down below on basically which bike you came to the channel because of. Let's roll the intro and let's get into today's video. What's going on YouTube? R2R Moto here. And today I'm going to be giving you guys a quick little update on the channel. So uh, rather recently on the channel we actually hit 300 subscribers which is amazing to see. I like no joke. It's amazing. Like to some of you guys 300 might not be a lot of subscribers but to me I mean that's more than friends I've had on Facebook in the past whenever I used Facebook because I mean who uses Facebook nowadays? I guess some people do. I don't know tangent that I don't want to have right now but uh besides that it's more than followers I've ever had on Instagram my bike is bogging even on this little hill ah, come on let's go but yeah I really do appreciate the support you guys have been showing on the channel whether it's liking the videos commenting on the videos or just overall just anything that you do basically to show that you guys are interested in the content it really is amazing to see but that good news of hitting 300 also leads me to have to talk about some sort of annoying news with the channel, I guess. And it's that you guys have been uh, especially commenting on the older videos like my, didn't know if that car was going to stop, my Z versus Grom video, which is not really that old, or the video of me buying the Z, the video of me buying the DRZ, videos related to those bikes that I put out a little bit a while ago. and. The thing is that for some reason YouTube has stopped telling me when you guys comment on those videos. Usually when uh, you guys comment YouTube will send me an email saying so and so person has uh, commented on your video or something of that nature and it's like I can go I can read it and then be like okay let me hop on YouTube real quick and actually respond to your comment. Wow that exhaust is loud in the tunnel. But rather recently, for some reason, whenever I go on my Gmail to actually check to see if any new comments have come in, it won't tell me. And then I'll hop on YouTube and it's still like in the little notification bell. For some reason, it won't even tell me that you guys have commented. The only way I can actually see it, I had to learn, was that I have to actually go into my channel and physically look at comments I haven't responded to. And I'm saying all this to say that if you guys leave a comment on one of the older videos of mine and I haven't responded to it right away, especially if it's some of the older videos, it's usually because YouTube hasn't alerted me and I really do mean to actually get back to you. I like to respond to everyone's comments or at least give you guys a heart if it is constructive criticism or feedback or something like that that I don't know how to specifically respond to but I do enjoy what you've had to say to me. I like to interact with you guys and talk with you guys. so. It's really a bummer that YouTube is basically not even telling me when you guys are commenting. So like I was saying, if you guys are commenting on the older videos or you have a question that you've asked me and I haven't gotten back to it, usually that's the problem. Now I have actually gone through and gotten back to a lot of people. So for those of you who I did get back to late, I apologize on that. And hopefully for the future now on, we won't have that problem anymore because I now know that I have to actually go in and manually check it most of the time. And then the final update, on the channel for today at least is going to be the fact that I don't know if some of you guys have already noticed this maybe you have maybe you haven't but I talked about in an earlier video of mine that we were going to be posting videos every Friday around 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time which I actually think that this video today will be mainly because I tried to film it another day and it didn't work out so today was the day that I was actually able to get back out and do it if you haven't noticed by now We've changed the upload schedule from 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Friday nights to now basically putting videos out Tuesday mornings at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, which, I mean, depending on when you watch, it doesn't really affect you, but I just wanted to bring this up based on the fact that I told you guys that if you weren't subscribed to the channel, but you wanted to come back and check out some content in the future, maybe you guys come to check out my content every week or something like that. 
but you haven't seen anything that interests you enough to subscribe I don't know but uh, if you are and you do come back to the channel on Fridays you'll notice that a video will probably already be posted about three days ago because I usually now post them on Tuesdays so I basically just say that to tell you guys that if you are checking out the channel and looking for new content that will usually come on Tuesday mornings I do however want to start posting again on Fridays as well have like two videos a week one on the Z and one on the DRZ I think that'd be really cool especially because I love both of these bikes so trying to split the time between the two of them is definitely difficult for me like right now I'm on this bike I filmed the original video of this on the DRZ but it didn't work out because of mic issues so I'm on the Z I'm doing this video right now but yeah I think that's really gonna do it for the updates on the channel I told you guys it's gonna be a quick little video just enjoying being out on the Z right now we are trying to get the little break in miles in we're at 500 hope you're turning we're at 504 miles of the 600 for the first service even though I've already done the first service at about 300 miles but you know we'll still do the break-in service at 600 as well but anyway as I always say in my videos if you guys enjoyed it hit that like button subscribe to see more content in the future this video like I said will probably be out on Friday so look forward to seeing another video about something I have no idea yet on probably either the Z or the DRZ coming on Tuesday and then hopefully another video again next Friday but yeah I'm going to go enjoy the bike and the weather because it is awesome I don't know why I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt I guess you know gear and protection but yeah if you guys like I said before all that jazz like the video comment you know I don't need to repeat it all over again but anyway this video is already longer than I expected it to be so I'll see you guys in the next one peace